this video, I just want to give you a quick tour of the latest version, or soon to be latest version, of WordPress. That's version 3.0. Because there's a lot of differences in this upcoming version that it might take a little bit of getting used to. So I just want to give you a quick rundown. Now, if you've got version 2.7 or newer of WordPress, then usually you can just come right on into your dashboard and then come on down to Tools and then click on Upgrade. That'll bring you to this page here. And you can just upgrade from here automatically, real quick. However, this being a beta version 3.0, it's not available just yet in this fashion. So we got to do it the old fashioned way. I went ahead and opened up my FTP client, and I'm using Qt FTP. And I just made a new directory just to keep the old stuff all safe and sound. And I did use the existing database, though, so I didn't go in and create a new database. So basically, just to give you a quick rundown on, on how you up date or I'm sorry on how you install a new version the manual way you just uh, unzipped the download and I got the beta version for 3.0 and just unzipped it from the desktop here and these are the contents and I just uploaded them to the new directory on my demo site and with this just like most of the other newer versions of WordPress there is no config file but you just type into your browser the uh, URL forward slash in the directory forward slash wp dash admin forward slash install dot php and then it will prompt you through the process of creating the wp dash config dot php file and from there you enter the and it you know walks you through the whole process simple simple walks you through the process of installing the details needed to work with your existing database and it's really that simple once you've got that then you click the appropriate buttons that it shows you and boom you got your installation now check this out uh, one of the biggest differences you're gonna see is the actual look here is the actual page that I was installed and I gotta tell you it looks a little bit like my uh, thesis theme just mainly because I'm a little biased and I love my thesis theme but uh, you can see the the the, the blue Kubrick design is not here and another thing too that's going to take a little bit of getting used to and that is the basis behind this is they're integrating the old WordPress with the old WordPress MU that's multi user format so this is going to work out pretty cool for those of us that have a lot of different blogs that want to be administered under one roof so this is going to work out pretty cool and you can of course allow others to create their own blogs under your roof as well nice little community feel and just as far as the I mean aside from the 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 actual look and I think it looks pretty clean and frankly I, I did not mind the old Kubrick uh, look but you know like anything else after a while it kinda just looks old as you can see the rest of this here looks pretty much the same as far as the options available and the look though as you can see is a lot different so let's go ahead and take a look at the inside the dashboard and here it looks pretty much the same so you start, until you start poking around a little bit you can see the screen options here still available here just as they were in the old and you got updates here whereas you did not in the past they were located down here in the tools section and under settings you've got there's going to be some differences in here as well and this being the beta version one just released today then you might want to hold off on any of this as far as installing it yourself until you get at least the beta version two this will get some of the bugs out and they're saying that some of the look is going to be different in the upcoming versions because they didn't get around to it just yet for the uh, release of beta one so just want to give you a quick rundown on all the cool stuff that's coming your way when it comes to WordPress I really do like this new look though thank you very much for checking out this video you have a great day